guys. It's quarantine. We're bored. I'm tired of being here. I'm just tired of it. Like, can can Miss Rana just can can Corona just stop? Can she just stop? Can she just maybe ease her foot off our necks? Like, just ease her foot just a little bit. Can a can a curve just go from like here here? Can it just can we just I just they ask you how you are. You just have to say that you're fine. Anyway. We in a we bored in the house and we in a house bored bored in a house and we in a house bored in a, in a house bored bored in a, in a house bored. He and Candell have been friends for about almost a year, a little bit over a year. We've been friends for about a year, about a year, I think a year and a half, about a year, about a year. Yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I'm perfect, beautiful, skinty, rich amazing talented kendall's kendall so yeah we're gonna be answering a bunch of just a series of questions we're gonna be answering a series of questions about each other and we're just gonna see how well we know each other. I'm obviously the better friend, so I'm gonna know him better. Duh. But before we do that, I just need to, I need to get my energy up. Alexa, play my shit. Playing specific songs is only available on Amazon Music Unlimited. Now we're not gonna talk about the fact that you just exposed me for being broke. Play Top 100 Radio. Mm -hmm. Play Top 100 Radio. Here's a station you might like. Today's hits on Amazon Music. I love you, baby. Alexa, skip this song. Candy, are you a lesbian? I don't remember my first impression of Kendall. Like that's, <laughs> I don't. Um, me and Kendall did Marching Man together and Kendall was a year older than me. And yeah, oh, we were all tennis together because we kind of like sucked, like we sucked um, at marching. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. My first impression was like, oh my God, it's another black guy. So Marte probably already knows my shoe size, even though my shoe size kind of varies. It is either a 12 or a 13. But I know for, I believe Marte's shoe size also is between like an 11 and a 12. No, I know him, y'all. I just know just him. him. Kendall's shoe size, child. The man has giant feet. I think he's a 13 in sneakers, but like, He'll buy a 12. I know he'll buy a 12, but I'm pretty sure he's a 13 of sneakers. Oh, yeah. 
I'm gonna answer this for he should know this already and don't clown me or judge me. I just like his music. It's anything by Chris Brown. Like I know any of the lyrics to all like almost all of his songs. Even though he'd be putting out albums with like forty something songs on Marte, don't do anything shady in this editing. I swear to God. I'll find you. I know where you live. What are you gonna do? He can't run from me. What are you gonna do? Hi, I'm gonna slash his tire to the tires in his car. All I gotta say is I like Chris Brown's music and that's just period. It's just period. I can't per se say his go to song, but I would probably say anything by Ariana Grande and or like a Disney Channel song. Maybe something from Hannah Montana because Marte. That's the answer to that. Uh hmm. He also like he likes a lot of artists that I don't listen to. Like our friend group likes to clown me because I listen to hood rap music, I guess. I don't really, but yeah, Ariana Grande. He loves him some Ariana Grande. He be trying to throw whatever little back he has back he has. Now I just know Black Carl Sheen is not trying to speak on me. I know Black Carl Sheen is not trying to talk about me. I was gonna keep it cute with you. I was gonna keep it. Um, his taste in music. Oh, I don't know what his go-to song is though, cause he will listen to literally anything. Like he'll listen to like R and B music one day, and then the next day he'll play like emo punk rock i um my go-to song would be child like anything from ariana grande like i love that bitch like best believe best believe if i get any money or if we gain any traction on this channel enough to generate money that's the first thing i'm buying is a ticket to her show like that's the first thing i buy after a ticket to LA, because that's where we want to live. But like, a ticket to her show. I freaking love her. She, yeah. Um, I don't know what Kendall's nickname for me is. Probably like, annoying or... Yeah. Okay, the next question. I don't know if I should say the next question in front of all of these because that's going to get repetitive and no one wants repetitive. Yes. Um, how can I fill some time slots of like content? Oh, Marte's going to hate this. I got Crocs. The yellow. They're nice and new. I have ADHD, so I get sidetracked, like, a lot. Something back there just moved, and y'all probably won't be able to hear it, so it's going to sound like I'm crazy, but something moved, and I heard it. Uh, there we go. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that one. That one would have some bass to it. I almost forgot what the question is. What was the question? Uh... Oh, what are your nicknames for each other? Okay, so I wouldn't say I have a nickname for him. More so insults. Like, but sometimes like Skinny Legend, you know. Uh, he looks like the, the cinnamon stick. What else? The cinnamon stick from Applejack's cereal box. Like, that's literally his doppelganger. They're twins, honestly. Um, in my phone, we are saved as he is Dirty Dan, and I, I guess I'm Pinhead Larry, even though he got a pinhead. But it's fine. I wanted to be Pinhead I I wanted to be Dirty Dan, but then again, I'm not dirty. I think it fits him. <gasps> um, what is his nickname for me? Yeah, it's probably Pinhead Larry. I don't know. He might have something else for me that I don't remember him calling me. And I will tell y'all that he be making up shit. My favorite 
other YouTuber is Lorette. Lorette is so funny. Um, I love his editing. Literally, I'd be trying to do his editing. I don't have like the proper stuff to do. I only have a phone, so I can't really do everything. But Lorette's hilarious. Every day is something. Like I can't ever just do a video. I love his style. His style, like his fashion sense, is really, really, really good. Um, literally, Lorette is like my inspiration and like the main reason why I wanted to do YouTube. Oh. Kendall's favorite YouTuber would probably be Kia. Kia, I watched Kia with like Kendall before. Um, she's really funny. She's a gamer. She does like Sims games. He's obsessed with The Sims. Like anytime I'm on call with him, anytime like me and our friends are talking to him, he's usually doing Sims or something Sims related. He loves The Sims, child. I don't get it. I don't get it. But he loves The Sims. So probably Kia. Uh, oh yeah, he did the, oh wait. I know Martez. He like put me onto this YouTuber. I never watched his videos before this, but his favorite YouTuber. And I'm actually surprised that this would be Martez's favorite YouTuber seeing the content that he makes. It's a gamer named Von Dylan. My favorite YouTuber. Kia is one of them. Kia makes Sims 4 content. If y'all don't know, I am. A little bit of an addicted to some food. You're fucking lying. Let me. I know he like back in Ariana Grande's like early days because obviously he is a Ari stan that he went and seen an Ariana Grande concert. I've only been to one concert ever, and it wasn't that good of a concert it was a decent concert but it was mindless behavior and we talk in mindless behavior oh my god i'm about to go on a rant now we talk mindless behavior like after prodigy but before ej girl what you can tell me back then that i wasn't a member of mindless behavior but uh, he went to see an ariana grande concert early in her career like red hair i've been to one concert he went to, child, this is so, anyway, he went to <laughs> a Mindless Behavior concert uh, back when they were on tour. Since I'm CEO of being that bitch, mine was like, first of all, it was free. Mine was this little like gymnastics skating, they called it like a spectacular. And the host was um, Ariana Grande. So I've seen Ariana Grande live, but I don't even count it because it was like, it was Ariana from like Victoria's Days, girl. Like it was a throwback. When she still had red hair, that was, that was. I really don't know. Okay, for me, what would it be? He's going to get this one completely wrong either way because this is going to be like so specific. Uh, mine would probably be, uh, probably I would want to be an ant farm. Maybe the either the first episode or the last episode when she was in New York because, wait, changed my mind. It would be in any scene of Black Lightning with China and McClane. But for Marte, I don't know. I would want to say that he would want to be in... A warehouse at Wanko's, the episode of Victorious, because, like, first of all, he'd get to be around Ariana Grande. If Kendall could be in... If Kendall could be in a TV show, I don't even know. Like, I feel like he would probably do, like, Black Lightning. He loves Black Lightning. Black Lightning is a good show. <laughs> Celebrity crush. Hmm. Myself. My 
my celebrity crush is probably probably like my pro my celebrity crush is probably either Timothy Chalamet, which I don't talk about, like no one would know that. Um, Sean Mendes. Oh my God, I forgot. No, I know who it is. I know who it is. I know who it is. Lil Nas X. I forgot about Lil Nas X. Why did I forget about him? Yeah, in my mind, we're married. Like that's my man. That's my man. Lil Nas hit my line. Like, I'm ready to go. Like, this hand? This hand? You could put a ring. This hand? You could put a ring on it, girl. You could put a ring on it. You could put a ring on it right here. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. 12 carat. Don't be shy. Put it right there. He's obsessed with China McLean, child. He's obsessed. Like, heart eyes. China McLean, if you meet a man, he should already know mine because I was literally just talking about it, but it's hands down China and McLean. I'm low key married to China and McLean. She just doesn't know it yet. Like, she, the marriage license is signed, it's just not in her signature. Marte's celebrity crush is definitely Lil Nas X. I know that one right off the bat. I'm, like, there's no question. There. I swear to God, if he says something else, he if he says something else, he's lying. Not even first talking to. Hold on, my dog's eating something he shouldn't be eating. You can go. Anyway. My hair is an absolute mess. This is going to be a weird jump cut because I really just like, ooh, look at them brows.